Tonight on the project, Dan Andrews is sworn into his brand new job. Is it really necessary to get a COVID boost every five minutes? Spoiler alert, yes. Plus, scientists reveal why Oriamic flurries could be more racist than you think. This is The Project. And first up tonight, we're joined by an A-list celebrity that everyone knows, loves, and definitely remembers, not obscure at all, Kamal. All right, prep the overlay, hashtag Kamal Mentum. The second he says what he's doing, I want that flashing on screen. Let's get that trending, people. Copy that. Yes, this is exactly what we needed. One final celebrity endorsement. This is gonna save my referendum and swing the polls back in our favor. Now, Kamal, you were originally voting no, but now that you're thinking more clearly, you've decided to vote yes? Well, after doing a little bit of research, I've decided to vote no. <laughs> um. What's going on? He's voting no, sir. I'm getting reports that he's done his own research. Oh no, he's thinking for himself. Shut it down, now. Hamish, come in Hamish. We're cutting to an emergency ad. Emotionally manipulative ad in three, two, one. Uh, this is the project, we'll be right- Here's some poor little kid we found on the side of the road. If you vote no, he's gonna die. Unless he gets an advisory panel. Yeah, that's what he needs. An advisory panel. You need to fix this, Hamish. What am I supposed to do? Remember your woke training. Be sanctimonious. Are you on emotion, not facts? You know what to do. Welcome back, Kamal. Why is it that you want poor indigenous children to die? No, 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 I don't want that. I'm, I'm just saying. Yeah, but this isn't really a time to be saying, okay? This is a time for listening. Or do you not want to hear about indigenous suffering? Yes, good, Hamish, good. Harness the power of your work training. All I know is $40 billion a year is going to indigenous people. Now, where's that money going? What the hell was that? That was a fact, sir. Where did he get that from? Us. It's the Productivity Commission's Indigenous Expenditure Report. God damn it! Don't panic. Hamish, he's right. But we've got to stump him, okay? Just get him to sign his sources. Be superior. Talk down to him. Um, Albo, I'm a white guy. Should I really be talking down to him? Now's not the time for ideological continuity, Hamish. Destroy him! Hang on. <laughs> Kamal. <laughs> Where'd you pull that number from? Well, I didn't just make it up. Yes, we got him. All right, label it misinformation, change the frame of the debate, throw out an alternative fact. Let's verbal him. Um, Kamal, the NIAA only spent a mere $4 billion last year. Well, that's specific, you know. I'm, I'm talking about the whole... Look at him, Hamish. He looks so foolish. Roll your eyes. That's it. Don't forget to be smarmy now. Show him who's boss. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think that's all we have time and energy for. Thanks, Kamal. Wait, just a... Coming up next, Oreo McFlurries. Oh, great recovery, gang. I reckon everyone's going to change their mind and vote yes now. What are the numbers, Steve? Ah, uh, looks like we had a total of six viewers. Yes, our highest rating episode ever. by D. Huxium for Pauline Hansen's One Nation Brisbane.